shit, man. That's my homie. He, I thank him for everything, but I'm not rich forever, bro. We is not a, a label no, no more. He independent. He sound with Interscope. I'm sound with 300. But y'all leave me alone with that shit, please. Can we we bosses, man? We became our own boss, man. <laughs> Mula. Check it up and check it out now. I got some bars for my man. Famous Dex, alright? My album not dropping this plan, and I'm just tweaking off the Zans. Oh man, goddamn, Richard Kid ain't my mans. Oh, listen, man, I got bars for days. My mumble rap tape is coming soon, but cocaina is a hell of a fucking drug, okay? Actually, let me uh change that up, because the great legend, of course, Rick James once said that, but... Perhaps these days we should say, man, that lean is one hell of a drug. Or maybe we should say them Zans one hell of a drug. Or them goddamn perks, okay? Now, I don't know what the fuck Famous Dex was on when he got on Instagram Live, but he said he ain't on a label no more. He ain't on Rich Forever, which is a label that signed him. Now, that label is a independent label that's headed by Rich the Kid, another artist. Now, I never believed that he had to sign to another artist, but he did. And I understood it because Rich the Kid is one of those guys that he's a social butterfly in music, and he uses connects very well to get to places that most rappers wouldn't so perhaps dex could capitalize on those connects that of course rich the kid got makes sense to me okay now they kind of moved around like brothers they even dropped a tape together of course uh jay chris is also on the label so i say you know what this is gonna work out for all these guys however frustration has built in for famous dex because he got on insta live said man i don't label now note he didn't say fuck rich the kid or nothing like that right he just said he ain't on the label now i had to reach out to rich the kid because I wanted to hear directly from the horse's mouth, is Famous Dex not down with Rich Forever anymore? Now, I reached out to Richard Kidd and I said, bro, I said, is Famous Dex still with Rich Forever? He said he ain't. I'm trying to confirm with you. I'm trying to be a journalist out here, dog. You know, I'm rocking. Now, this is what he said to me directly. He says, LOL, pray for Dexter. He's too high. He signed to me and has a distribution deal under 300 under my Rich Forever venture. He's just a little upset his album's not dropping as planned, okay? Now, you know what? Rich the Kid sometimes is a liar. He's lied to me multiple times in the past, but in this situation, I think he's telling the goddamn truth, okay? And by the way, I got to salute to Rich the Kid because I do think he's a he's a black, independent entrepreneur making a living for himself. And not only that, the mere fact that he's a young rapper and he has his own label shows where music should be going, okay? All these cosigns that you're not signing, nigga, okay? Too much cosigns, not enough signs, okay? Or sign-ins. So basically... He got his label. He's basically saying that Famous Dex is a little bit upset that his album hasn't came out yet. And I could understand that to be true. You know why? I would imagine that's true because as an artist, you want your album to be dropping whenever your fans want it, whenever you want to put it out. But, of course, as a label and, of course, for uh, Rich the Kid and, of course, for 300 who distributes the record, they want a motherfucking hit song to push the record, okay? So I can understand the disconnect there where Dex wants his songs or his music out and the label's waiting for other stuff to kind of develop. So it is what it has been, but I hope these guys really um, get back together. The fans have kind of sensed that there's been some friction. Hopefully they don't end up going separate ways. And even if they do try to go separate ways, according to Rich the Kid, he got that paperwork, dog. So, oh man, goddamn, bring your ass to court. You ain't getting out of this goddamn contract. Again, Dex is on paperwork. Dex, I fuck with heavy, but you got to honor that contract. This is a thing that people realize after you sign something and then you get mad about it later. You got to honor the contract or you're going to have to holler at somebody to try to see if they can get you out of it. But right now you are still with Rich forever. And I hope you and Richard Kid talk it out real soon. Get in the comment box. Make sure you guys like him. By the way, I like how y'all ran up the like button. On that take case story, okay? Because y'all get this to at least like 6 or 7K likes. I would really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Love y'all been showing me. I'm in Jamaica right now. Cool in. Let me know what y'all want to hear from me.